So a lot of writers have this idea that they should just um, be able to write and the writing should sell itself. And I'm not fully sure, truthfully, where this comes from, but it's definitely a very real thing. And what I can tell you is from the different authors that I know, like New York Times bestselling authors, because I have a few of them that are friends of mine, is that they're all exceptionally good promoters. So obviously they have great ideas, they're great at articulating, but they also realize that ideas by themselves must be shared, they must be articulated, they have to promote themselves. They connect with other people and get those ideas out there. Whether that's partnerships with people that have bigger distribution, partnerships with people that have some sort of platform, they still all are really good at promoting. Now you might be like, well, I'm not good at promoting. I don't know how to do that. And it's like, well, cool. <laughs> no one comes out of the womb knowing how to do that. That's something that you learn. It's a learned skill. And to me, that's exciting because just like you put an effort to become a better and better writer, you can put an effort to become a better and better promoter of your books, your products, your writing, to connect with people. You can learn how to become more charismatic, more interesting, more articulate with your ideas. You can learn how to build a list. You can learn how to uh, connect with other people who have a list and an audience that you don't have. These are all learnable skills. So, you know, instead of writing yourself off or saying, well, I don't know how to do that or I'm not a promoting type person, it's like, well, great. Those are skills that you can learn. So begin the process of learning those skills. Because again, you know, several friends of mine are New York Times bestselling authors. And the reason that they are is because they didn't stop promoting. They promoted, 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 networked, all that kind of stuff. So that is the difference between, you know, something that really, really becomes big and something that does not. So anyway, take that for what it's worth. Um, and yeah, see you soon.